After a fight broke out near the Syracuse University campus late Friday night, Syracuse police do plan to question every officer who responded after some witnesses say the officers didn't step in to help. Universities calling the violence appalling. It was all caught on video. We want to warn you, you're going to see some of it, and some people may find it upsetting. News 10 Line's Adrian Smith digging into what exactly happened. After a Friday night football game up on the SU Hill, Syracuse police were called to University Ave and Marshall Street for reports of a fight with what police describe an uncooperative victim. Another caller stated that there was a fight in front of the Sheridan. At least four, four people fighting. It was frantic on the phone and just had to send the police at 2353. Yeah, University Ave and Marshall Street. University Ave and Marshall. Yeah. In this video taken by witnesses, you can see at least four people kicking and punching one man on the ground, accusing him of stealing their wallets. You can hear the man on the ground asking them to, quote, check my pockets. Syracuse police tell News Channel 9 it's too early in the investigation to do an interview, but a spokesperson for the department says the officers who responded to the scene on Friday night got there as the fight was ending. 522, no active fight. But two witnesses who watched the fight and took this video pressed the officers why they didn't do more and take action to find the suspects. It's not about my attitude. It's the fact that someone got beat up and you won't do anything about it. He got jumped for no reason. And you won't do anything. If he wanted to press charges, we would have to that. But he doesn't. He won't sleep. Okay. You guys are pointless. You guys are pointless. Still a lot of unanswered questions, but the chief of SU's Department of Public Safety and the senior vice president of student experience say it's still unclear if the individuals involved have any relation to the university. If the investigation reveals a student is involved, they'll face immediate repercussions, including interim suspension. Jeff and Christy. All right, Adrian. Thank you. A lot of unanswered questions, but if you recognize any of the people in that video, if you know what happened, Syracuse University and Syracuse police are asking for your help to identify them. You can anonymously send in your tips, call Syracuse Police at 315-442-5200 or DPS at 314-443-2224.